Hi guys. Um, sorry you can't see my mouth, be but the camera is doing something odd with my mouth. I don't know. But I was watching TD Jakes and um, I I just was on YouTube and I was surfing YouTube uh, as I do as we all do from time to time and I was watching TD Jakes and a phrase he said st stood out to me he said this is not it and I have been I'm a very private person when it comes to online things and whatever I love preaching but um, sharing things from my own life, I don't really do that because, um, you know, um, my privacy and my family's privacy, um, but I've been going through a lot these past two years, and that statement so resonated with me that I, that I put something on my Facebook that said, this is not it. Meaning, the place I am now is not where I'm going to be. The financial situation that I'm in now is not where it's going to be. The um, health situation that I'm in now is not the end for me. Th this can't be it. This is not it. I'm not going through all this stuff that I'm going through just for me. I'm going through it for other people. And that's what, what I wanted to encourage you about today. Because um, I know I'm not the only one going through a hard time or whatever. And I didn't put this video up to get sympathy like, Oh, Rachel, you you get through it and whatever. I know I'll get through it because God is with me. But I put this video up to encourage you to say whatever situation you are now, however down you feel now, it's all in the lesson that you're going to get from whatever, whatever you're going through. And I just am putting this video up to tell you, this is not it. You are not going to live in in that rat nest forever. You are not going to be in that dead end job forever. The vision that God has given you will come to pass. Everything that he's told you will, will come forward. Everything that he's promised you will come to pass. He's a God of his word. If he's not a God of anything else, he's a God of his word. And he says he is not slack concerning his promises. And whatever he promised you, no, no matter if it was 10 years, no matter if it was 15 years ago, just keep believing and it will be done. If he promised you healing, it will be done. If he promised you a husband or a wife, it will be done. If he promised you finances, it will be done. All of this, all whatever your this is, is preparing you for your next level. So hold, hang tight, hold tight, and I'm praying for you. God bless.